are as far as the eye could see, shutting down the streets of downtown Lawrenceburg. There was something for everyone at the 8th cruising to a cure for ALS. Thousands of people, hundreds of cars, it's a great turnout. Everything from motorcycles to muscle cars, even a car covered in a chalkboard letting kids show off their creativity. Uh, something for kids to do at car shows because most time it's don't touch nothing. And this is something they can actually touch and interact with. People traveling in from all across the country to help raise money for a good cause. One driver even making the 11 hour trip from Connecticut. We're just seeing this show grow year over year and a lot of out of towners tell all their friends and all their group of friends comes the following year and it's just it's really humbling and I'm very thankful. When he was just 16 years old, Logan Lawrence started the car show in honor of his grandfather who he lost to ALS in 2009. We would either go to a car show on the weekends and his uh, stepside pickup, or we would go race at the drag strip at Edgewater. And, uh, you know, I, I really miss those memories. It's grown from 415 cars in the first year to close to 1,000 this year. I do the show in memory of my grandfather, but I've met so many families that are currently affected by ALS and have been affected. And, you know, forming those relationships with those families make this show mean even more. The past seven shows have raised a total of $215,000. Thanks to the funds that are brought through this event, we're able to fund our quality of life grants. We have a ramp program within the state of Indiana uh, that we loan out ramps to families that need them and, and don't have the funds to provide them for themselves. And Logan's planning to keep the show rolling for many years to come. It, it, it's awesome. You know, I'm really beyond words. In Lawrenceburg, Tyler Matt, Local 12 News. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.